Good to see you back. And welcome to The Black MacGyver. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And today I got a goodie for you. I have a 99 B3000 that I'm gonna be changing. Let me, let me adjust. A coil. How do you know when you need a coil? I'm gonna show you. Well, it started that time. Can't ever catch them, right? But I know I need a coil because sometimes I have intermediate starting issues, especially when it's cold. It's about 30 degrees right now. So um, right now I'm gonna get right into it. I'm not gonna edit this at all. It's gonna be raw. All of my content is gonna be raw. So you guys can have a, 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 a very intimate experience with me. Okay, the lighting is is great. It's fantastic. Uh, it's because the sun is out. It's a uh, it's a great temp right now. But let's get into this video. What you're gonna need is tools, obviously, right? So you're gonna need well some type of toolbox. I don't care who it's from. I don't care where you get it. You're gonna need a toolbox. Okay. Second, you're gonna need a trusty, dusty ratchet. I don't care where you get it, again, you're gonna need it, okay? And we're gonna go through, uh, sorry. Another thing you're gonna need. You're gonna need a new coil, of course, if that's what you're replacing. You're gonna need a new one. You're gonna need some gloves, cause I like to protect my hands. I don't like all that black stuff in my fingernails. That is the worst. Try talking to a woman and you know, giving her a high five and you got all this dookie in your fingers. That is the worst. Anyway. So. My recommendation is, is to figure out the correct orientation of the new coil. What do I mean by orientation? If you if you if you if you look if you take a look here come closer come closer come closer to me you see how you have whatever it's one three five two four six or vice versa I don't care which one it is one, three, five, two, four, six, right? All I'm gonna do is I'm gonna figure out which way, this is the easiest way, and this is quick, very fast. I'm gonna do this in less than 10 minutes, okay? So, of course, if I'm looking at this, where's my connector? My connector is here, right? So, obviously, where's my, Where's my, where's my connection pointing on the new coil? This way. So this is my orientation. Now that we have that figured out, here's the, here's the easiest way that you can do this without having to worry about, and this is on a B3000, 99 B3000. I'm pretty sure it's the same on Ford Rangers, uh, maybe Explorers, uh, maybe Mercury Mountaineers, Maybe, because they're all about the same. They're all fours. But uh, again, so my orientation is this way, right? So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take each, each one of my wires and I'm just gonna place them here. 
here. And here. Alright. And then I'm going to take these ones. Here. Here. And here. Okay. All right. Now that I have, I know that the orientation's right. I'm not picking my brain trying to figure out, wait, which one, three, five, two, four, six, which one is, uh, 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 I'm not doing any of that. I'm killing all that noise. I'm gonna pop my connector off. See, pop my connector off. And then I'm gonna take my ratchet this happens to be a 5 16 and I'm gonna, oh no, it's smaller. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> All right guys, hold on. Let me, let me take a look here, see what we've got. I think I made a, ooh, so. It's a nine thirty seconds, or maybe a seven millimeter. So, where did I just put it? Oh, take your nine thirty seconds. Can you see it? Nine thirty seconds. All right, and let's go ahead and whiz these off. Should be four bolts. If you don't, you're missing one. If you don't have four bolts, you're probably missing one, but I'm sure that it may still work. Uh, also, make sure that you, there's a little ground on the back side of this. I don't know if you can see, let's see. Let me lean this thing up a little bit. Let's try this. Let me get you guys a little closer. I don't know if you guys can see, but there's a little ground. Right here. Can you see this? Yeah, you can see it. It's got like a little connector in there. Uh, but you wanna make sure that you put that on or else your coils won't fire properly. Cause you know, you gotta you got, you got have a ground and any 12 volt uh, sequence, it's not, it's not quite like, you know, like a receptacle or anything. It has to have a start and an end point. Well, what's the start point? Your battery, what's the end point? Your ground. So then you complete the circuit, then you have a pulse. Well, I'm not, I'm not gonna bore you with all that. You know, it's all up here. But uh, yeah, you wanna take all your screws out one by one, set them to the side. You don't wanna lose anything because uh, you know, you might, uh, it might not work properly if it's missing a bolt or it might not seal properly. I mean, with this coil, it doesn't really matter. You know I mean, you probably, you probably can do it with two bolts, but you wanna have all the bolts, especially if you're a type that likes to fix and flip and you go to flip something and then somebody notices that one of those bolts are missing, they're like, man, what'd you do to this truck, man? Don't lie to me, man. You're selling me some garbage. <laughs> so, <clears throat> you wanna make sure that you, you put everything on, you take everything off, you put everything on correctly. Uh, let's see. I'm just taking all this off. And I'm showing you this, 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 this video is only nine minutes long so far. So you see, I started it with you, went through my little introduction. there almost
almost there. All right. So, old coil is out. Drop it on the floor and just <clears throat> put your new bolts back in. Take your connector. Oh, oh, sorry about that. Sure it's in. And I'm just gonna put my ground in to make sure that you know I have the right coil and it's gonna fire properly, you know, all that little jazz. <clears throat> and I think at the auto parts store they had you know two different kinds. They said that uh one was a top and one was a side. I chose the side because I feel like it looks a little cleaner to me. And that's just my personal opinion. Uh, At least my ground and one on the side and then I'm gonna try to turn it over to make sure everything's all right because this connector had a little bit of trouble getting in there so I want to make sure that uh, <clears throat> I want to make sure that I have the right coil and this is the one that the auto parts store gave me now, sometimes you got to check them fools man you gotta be like hey man you make sure you order me the right stuff all right or else it's me and you it's getting kind of warm take this off show my muscles yeah show my freaking muscles on them yeah all right back to back to business all right Have a look and let's get this thing all buttoned up that lighting is hitting ain't it maybe too much lighting maybe All right, almost home. And I showed you the entire process in its entirety. I didn't take, I didn't, I didn't, you know, I'm not editing anything. I'm not taking anything out. This is the raw footage. All right, the raw footage of me putting up this, uh, this here. I didn't, I didn't cut anything. I didn't fast forward it. I didn't do none of that. You guys got the whole, and it's only 14 minutes long. That's it. Almost there. Almost there. All right. Make sure this ground is, is secure. All right. I'm gonna make sure all of my plug wires are nice and pushed down and clicked in. You'll hear a click. I'm gonna make sure this is in and I'm gonna go and start it. guys <sighs> sometimes these people will just make you want to slap them but you can't you have to be a good human being 
Now, what the problem is, it's the orientation. But you see, See how this one is? Now this it, it's the exact same that I had on this one. So now I gotta figure it out. But that's all right. I'm just gonna record another video for you all to, uh, to see. How do I figure out the orientation? Or I can put it in this one. But I think that should be a separate video. So again, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I showed you how to install a coil. And in another video, I'm gonna show you how to get the correct orientation, how to find it, all right? So over and out, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Black MacGyver, we're coming.